Assalamualaikum and a very good day to you all. In this video, I would like to share with you about integration by substitution. But before that, let's consider um, something like this. If we are going to integrate uh, x cubed, then it's easily we can get x to the power of 4 divided by 4 plus c. Okay? And But what happens if we have something like this? Um, x squared x cubed plus 3 to the power of 4 okay so this kind uh, this integrant is quite it's quite uh, it's quite complex so we have to um, perform a substitution method okay what is substitution method it's a, a method where we simplify a, a expression or something to become something that is manageable for example you've done this before okay for example we can factorize something like this okay we can factorize this right easily we can get x plus 2 x plus 2 equals 0 but what happens if i'm going to increase the power with i double the power like this okay what you have been taught back in high school is that we are letting m equals x squared so that m will be square for this one Okay, and then 4m plus 4 equals 0. So, from here, we can use our beloved calculator to factorize. Okay, m plus 2 equals 0. Therefore, m equals minus 2. Okay, m minus 2. And then we can substitute back x squared minus 2. Okay, we can, we can uh, solve it further. It's not... Uh, it's not it's not that's not the end okay but this is the one of the example of substitution method that you've done this is the part that you simplify it to you reduce it from something power four something like this to something like the be below over here okay so that is what we call substitution so whatever integrand complex integrand that we get we are going to reduce them to this three basic form okay a is when we get uh, f prime multiplied by f x with a certain power. Okay, so what we are going to achieve, we are going to integrate to become that one. Okay, and then next, uh, f prime. Oh, before that, I would like to share with you. This n can be any power, any number. Number. Number x set okay negative one okay why because if it's negative one then it falls to the second form over here down here so what is the second form second form is f prime divided by f x why because we integrate we will get ln fx plus c and last form is f prime exponent f to the power of fx so that we can eh, i lose the exponent exponent to the power of f x plus c okay so how we're going to uh, perform that there are five steps okay five steps that i think would simplify uh, the process okay these five steps must be in the work in the in your working okay it must be in in the in the order that i have mentioned yeah the first one is we find the fx that we want okay the blue one the blue fx in this three basic form on the uh, left hand side over here okay and then next we are going to find du and dx and then put number one and number two inside the box okay why we will we will see later why eh? next one we substitute from the box to simplify remember in this method, we want to substitute to simplify. If we substitute and we cannot simplify, then our substitution is useless. Okay? It means that we need to use uh, some other things that we have to substitute. Eh? Okay. Uh, next, we integrate with respect to x. And last but not least, we substitute u back into the, integ uh, the thing that we have integrate. Okay? Maybe we, um, you need to watch uh, another video. Uh, for the examples. Okay, thank you for your time and attention. Assalamualaikum. Have a good day.